Long ago, the giant Carlon tree, the essence of balance and order in the world, withered and died. By the will of the heavens, the world was cleaved in two. Many years later, the Chosen of Regeneration planted a new world tree to take the place of the withered giant Carlon tree. The birth of the new world tree also brought about the unification of Silverot and Tetha Ala. The two worlds were now reborn as one. The world was at the dawn of a bright new era, or so it seemed. hot deserts were blanketed with snow. Bountiful lakes dried up and withered. Forests burned to ash as glaciers melted into the sea. These phenomena fanned the flames of dissatisfaction within the hearts of the people, leading to the birth of a monster. A resistance organization was formed by the oppressed people of Silverot to defend themselves. United against the perceived evils of Tetha Allah and the Church of Martel, they called themselves the Silverati Liberation Front, the Vanguard. Punishment for this crime 
That howl? I feel like I've heard it before. Maybe it's just my imagination. Good morning, Aunt Flora. That how? Monsters have been going down into the lake bed since dawn. I I'm sorry. Why are you apologizing? Uh, uh. Despicable child, always so indecisive. You're hardly like Lana at all. You must take after Raysol. I'm sorry. There's that howl again. It sounds like it's coming from the Fountain Plaza. Lloyd. Hey, Emil! We saw that! Bow to Lloyd the Great! I... Uh, I already did. No, no you, you didn't. didn't! You don't like Lloyd the Great, do you? That's why you're trying to destroy our city. Because Lloyd restored 